In this video I am going to show you everything about MetaMask and after this video you will know how to install MetaMask, how to uninstall MetaMask, how to add tokens to MetaMask, how to add custom tokens to MetaMask and how to swap tokens on MetaMask wallet. If you are new to MetaMask guys then MetaMask is a wallet for ERC20 tokens. This means that all tokens which are ERC20 if you open like for example coin market cap and if you are looking on tokens guys then you will see ethereum contract here on each token which is erc20 token you can click here and this is the contract for particular token which is ethereum token so these projects which are erc20 tokens these are projects which are built on ethereum blockchain technology guys and if you click on explorer you can see everything about the token so first thing as you can see here on my browser i have here on my chrome browser and i will be adding this to my chrome browser in this video if i click here on this this fox icon this opens up my metamask wallet and here is at the very bottom you can see import using account seed phrase and where to get that seed phrase i will also show you so you will need this seed phrase if you will want to for example restore your wallet to another browser for example if you close this browser or on another computer if you would want if you will have that seed phrase this will act pretty much as your private key of your wallet of your erc20 wallet guys but i will uninstall this wallet in a second i'm just showing you this so you know what i'm talking about if you click there guys you will see their wallet seed phrase you can enter it there you can add their password and you can restore your wallet if you want in the future guys okay but now let's remove this wallet from my browser if you would want to just remove it just right click on it and click here on remove from chrome and click on remove i have removed this wallet which was my metamask wallet from chrome browser now at all and if i would want to install a new wallet all we need to do is go into google and in google uh, type in metamask wallet hit enter and you will see this first metamask.io just click into that url and you will get redirected to this page and here you see a crypto wallet and gateway to blockchain apps and here click on download now and here you will see different features for which uh, operating systems or for which software you can download this metamask wallet as you can see here is chrome browser ios if you are using ios or for example android if you are, want to use it on your android phone but we will be doing this on chrome browser so click here install metamask for chrome and it will redirect you to chrome web store where are extensions for chrome browser and here you can see add to chrome just click on that button and here click on add extension and it will add that extension to your chrome browser here now it says welcome to metamask connecting you to ethereum and the centralized web we are happy to see you get started just click is there get started no i already have a seed phrase if you have a seed phrase you can recover like i showed you previously guys you click here on import wallet but we will be creating a new wallet we have yes let's get started and create a wallet here click on i agree and here click a password i will enter some password you can enter whatever you want there guys for your password this will be your password to open your wallet and click there i have read and agreed to the terms and click create here you will see secret backup phrase you need to write this phrase out if I click on this phrase you can see that this is the phrase which where is where are words and these words are in particular order and you need to copy or paste it out somewhere but you don't lose this phrase you can restore this wallet with this seed phrase from any other browser guys so just copy and paste it and once you actually i will copy it and i will save it on my uh, notepad as you see child biology brain fever and later observe and so on and so forth and now we will need to just verify click here next and here you need to verify in that order to make sure that these words are correct in your key phrase which you just got we need to verify them and to do this we need to in exact the same order enter them here in this field just by clicking on these as you see first one is child so we click on child second one is biology brain fever as you see biology brain then we had fever and last three words we have glass come and argue as you see glass 
come and argue they have to be in exactly the same order and click confirm and this says congratulations because it you just verified that this is your new key phrase and like i said don't you lose those words and exa in exactly the same order as you have them and with those words in the same order you can recover this wallet from any chrome browser at all you can recover and create a new metamask wallet and click all done guys so next thing if you would want to add that extension to your google chrome browser you if you left click here at the top guys you will see this metamask and you can click this pin pin extension and it will be pinned at the very top in your browser if it is not there at, at the very beginning guys and this is web version as you can see here we can close web version now uh, close it down and then we can click on this fox icon if you click on that fox icon just click on it you will see that this is your metamask wallet now but if you would want to see and it is easier if you are using your pc guys too and if you are using your pc it is easier to use a web version which will open in whole your browser all you need to do is click on these three dots and click on expanded view and it will open the same wallet only in your browser and it is easier to use currently we have ethereum and if you would like to add another token just click on add token for for example we could add link as you see there is chain link just click on it and click next and click add tokens and go back to your wallet guys and you will see now another token which is ethereum and link and if you would like to send some link to this address or send any other token to this address all you need is just click on this account one just copy on it and you send all tokens your ethereum tokens your link tokens or any other projects to this one address guys because if you will send all those tokens to this one address from from for example binance or coinbase wherever you buy them they will be sent here into this wallet and if you will send for example link tokens to this address the link will appear here guys and you will see link if you will send to this address ethereum then ethereum will appear here but for example if you are trying to add some token for example here as you see add token at the very bottom if i click on add token and i will need to find bonded finance as you see there is no such a bond finance token however this is very new token and that's why metamask still doesn't see that token so if you are trying to add some token here in your search add tokens which you can't find you have another option by to add these tokens by that token contract like i showed you at the very beginning guys you can go to coin market cap for example and on coin market cap uh, all tokens has their contract addresses as you see ethereum contract for this bonded finance token is here all you need to do is just click on this ethereum contract just copy it go back into your wallet i will just close this down as i don't need this go back into your wallet and here you can click on custom token and here you can paste in this token contract address just paste it in there and it will straight away find it that this is bond token bonded finance token as you can see this is bonded finance and its shortcut or ticker is bond guys so it straight away added it you just click here next and click on add tokens and it added this token also to your wallet and then click on this logo for example or click on this back and now you have added link and you have added bond token so if you can add adding tokens because sometimes as it was also my problem at the very beginning I tried to add some new tokens which were on for example which I wanted to transfer to my metamask wallet and I tried to search them here for example bond and they were not coming up so another way how to do it just by clicking a custom token and then you all you need is ethereum contract for that token or if you are looking for example on ether scan which where are all tokens you can find the token here first just by typing a name of the token making sure that you have the token and you can also get that contract here as you can see here is exactly the same contract and for each token on ether scan there is a contract address if you this is just information if you don't know it and this is exactly the same contract for this token as you can see for this particular token there is 1 billion total supply there is holders there is transactions and so on and so forth guys and 
I am showing bonded finance because I created just a video for this one and currently it has for one year 50% staking and that's why I'm getting into this token myself and that's why I'm adding this MetaMask wallet but this is not a subject about this particular project. So let's get back to this uh, MetaMask as, we, as you can see here we have Ethereum link and bond and now for example any tokens which you would want to send from other cryptocurrency exchanges for from wherever you bought them you are sending to this one address guys if you would want to send from your wallet uh, you just click into that particular token if you have here some link and you click on send and there you are typing here here is here you are pasting in address to which you want to send that particular token whether it's your coinbase or whether it's a binance exchange or any other exchange guys there you are pasting in the address of where you are sending it but you are sending all your tokens to this address and another thing is that always you have to have some ethereum because if you will want to for example send something or swap some tokens from one token to another you will need ethereum if you will not have ethereum you will not be able to send or send any or swap any tokens as you need to pay transaction fees in ethereum so first thing what you need to do is send some ethereum to this address so you have at least some ethereum for transaction fees if you want to swap tokens as i will show you just in a second what you also can do here or if you want to send tokens out from this wallet because if you will send for example link tokens to this wallet and you will not have any ethereum you will not be able to send them out from this wallet because you will not be able to pay transaction fees so you will need some ethereum also on this wallet then we have also here on metamask swap feature which means that in many cases you can swap many tokens here straight away from this wallet just by clicking swap you select token from which you want to swap for example if you have a link token you click on link and here you can swap it to ethereum or you can swap it to usdt for example and so on and so forth you can do it straight away this on your wallet another thing what you can do with metamask is if you are going to uniswap also if you can't find some tokens you go into uniswap.org as you can see it's their address and click on here on launch app and you can also swap tokens just by adding here your wallet first thing what you will need to do is click here on the right top corner connect wallet where you are connecting your metamask wallet and after you have connected your metamask wallet you can also uh, as you can see here click next and click connect and it now connected your wallet and then after you have connected your wallet here you also select token from which you want to swap and you have to have the token on your metamask wallet and to which token you want to swap for example currently i uh, i selected and i want to swap and so this means i have to have some and tokens on my wallet and i want to swap them to ampl tokens whatever tokens are there and they will be added also after this swap here on my metamask wallet so this is as easy to swap different tokens by using uniswap as well if you can't find these tokens on your metamask wallet if you will click here on this fox icon this is where your wallet will open up and you will see all balances also here but like i said it's easier to work on desktop version just by in expanded view if you click on these three dots and click on expanded view and it will open you this view and this is the same wallet as you have here in the this extension in this pin and extension and here you can see all your balances and so on and so forth so yes guys this is metamask tutorial for absolute beginners if you have more questions ask them in comments but in general if you are sending any tokens you are sending to this address on your main metamask address guys if you are if and you have to make sure that you have some ethereum if you want to send out uh, some tokens or if you want to swap here by clicking on this swap because you will not be able to do it if you uh, if you will not have at least some ethereum on your metamask wallet already because you will not have enough for transaction fees and i hope that you found this video useful if you did leave a like share this video subscribe to my channel if you're new and see you in the next one